Well, th these are based on industry estimates. Uh, the industry reckons around about a third of the uh, 200 million pounds worth of electricity that is stolen each year goes to cannabis farms. And we also have uh, verification of this sort of the size of this problem from the police. Now, the police are catching about 8,000 of these cannabis farms a year. Now, that figure has doubled over the last four years. So it is a problem. And what Ofgem is proposing is a new set of rules for energy suppliers so they can crack down more effectively on electricity theft. I don't mean to, I'm asking for a manual here, but how do you steal electricity? Well, uh, uh, yeah, it's, it's a good question. We're not going to explain how, how you do it. But uh, broadly speaking, you either bypass the meter or you tamper with the meter. And what Ofgem is proposing is that the industry goes away and sets up a national risk assessment service that covers the whole country that will allow suppliers to better pool intelligence, uh, so to better identify people who are doing this. And presumably, the, the, the cannabis growing, is in, it seems, is incredibly intensive because you do it inside, but you need, obviously, light for photosynthesis, if I can say it. That's correct. I mean, obviously, uh, the police are there to crack down on illegal activity. What we want to do is to make sure suppliers are supporting the police, uh, which many of them do. And we need to give credit to the industry. The industry catches around about 25,000 people a year uh, stealing electricity. But what we're developing with the industry is a framework that will hopefully allow suppliers to crack down harder on the people that are stealing electricity. What does this do to my electricity bill? Well, on average, it adds around about £7 to your electricity bill. And this is why Ofgem is very keen to make sure that electricity theft is tackled as effectively as possible. Because we want to see a fair energy market for consumers. And obviously, it's not fair if people are paying for stolen electricity.